Hello, this is Breuer, and welcome back to an episode of our Let's Play for Old World, playing as Rome. We are year 95. Actually, again, I don't know how many years you actually go. Does it say somewhere? It doesn't say anything here. Um, Grace is currently in the lead for overall total points. Uh, we've got four out of ten ambitions. We're about to finish a fifth one. Uh, so it puts us halfway there. That's not too bad. Controlling two Legionnaires... I don't know if I've even got the text for Legionnaires yet, or we'll have to we'll have to check. I guess Legionnaires, sorry, <laughs> Legionnaires. Um, we'll see. We'll see if I can track down the stuff for that, because that'd be cool to get a couple of those in. Just keep working towards the ambitions. Acropolis is completed. Daughter is born. Um, accept our gift to end the war. No hard feelings. Let's call it off. We are the superior power to match tribute. No, except our gift. Uh, we'll give them a whole bunch of money. I mean, we could technically... We can afford it. We got plenty of money. Sure. You know, we'll accept their proposal. It doesn't mean we start losing money for 40 years, but... What's 100... Uh, that's not that much. We're, we're still going to have tons of money. Commerce studies. What role best suits Hortensia? Uh, they're both a net of plus three. Governor or ambassador. Or gives us a leader mission to adopt, adopt a child. I don't know. Let's try that one out. Choose research. All right. So we need to figure out what's going to get us the legionaries. Uh, this actually opens up spy masters and walls. Interesting and lucky enough. Uh, iron. Oh, it gives us just a boost to iron, uh, stone, and uh, lumber. Interesting. Uh, let's go see if we can figure out where the legionaries come in at. There's towers. I mean, I assume the legionaries are going to be, look like a legionary thing. There's axemen, longbowmen, pikemen. None of those say legionaries. Swordmen, free legionary. I mean, that gives us a bonus card for a free legionary, but doesn't get us the legionary. There's the hastatus hast or whatever. That's our, I think, our unique thing. I don't see legionaries anywhere. Crossbowmen. Am I just missing the legionaries? Huh. I mean, it's got to be in here somewhere, and I'm just completely blind to it. Well, I mean, at least working our way up to here will get us a free legionary eventually, so... Maybe we go for his doctrine in the list. Doctrine is not in the list. Uh, monasticism, no. Military drill way back here. Maybe that'll help start putting us towards something. But no, it's not even needed for this one. What is needed for this one? Just doctrine. That's assuming that's even the legionary thing, which I don't have evidence that that is. We'll plug that in so that at least it pops up. But it looks like none of these go towards that. Um, I mean, a bunch of stone would be useful, to be honest. Four years to get us basically ten years worth of stone as well as some... I mean, the lumber and the iron we don't really need. Could also be nice to open up Spy Master. You know, though, let's get the military drill. It's one year. It'll reset that whole thing. Maybe it'll open up one of the other things that gives us the legionaries. One of our most prized generals has tired of the endless campaigns, wars, and skirmishes. He's stepping down to enjoy the rest of his days as a man of peace and solitude. Uh, if we have stone, we could erect a monument in his name. Um, or we can get some legitimacy. I, mean, I kind of like the record of the monument, so we need 140 stone. So let's go up here uh, and buy. Oh, that's a lot of money. Maybe that's too much. Never mind. <laughs> we'll just do this one. Oh, that does lower the Julius opinion of us, which we don't want. Nope, we're going to do this. It's, it's fine. Shift to buy 110. There we go. Monument in his name. 
Whatever. It's fine. Uh, let's see here. What do we want you to do? Lumber mill doesn't feel super critical. Quarry. Stone is our weakest thing at the moment. Uh, just a bunch of military units right now. Let's go ahead and at least get these guys healed up. You can always add the general, I suppose. Sure. You can be that. So we'll heal you. Add a general to you. Fighting from urban. Get some crit from this one. Heal you. Sure, we'll add generals to wherever we can. Why not? I don't want to be. I don't want to put me in charge, though. To be honest, uh, that actually gives us engineer, which is not useful for the archer. So, let's go. To one of these other guys or girls, whichever. Um, you have lots of citizens, so I don't know. We might as well take advantage of the citizens where we can. Kind of want to get you a promotion. It's going to cost us a little bit of stuff, but feels like a good move. Combat garrison, bloodthirsty aggressor versus siege versus damage units fighting from urban. We'll just take the combat. You have a free promotion. I do like the bloodthirsty. It just feels like we're going to we're going to frequently have times to uh, attack wounded units. Close to getting our sixth archive. I think we're like one or two years away or something like that. Oh, there we go. We were one year away. Still have no idea how to get our legionaries. Um, yeah, so we'll have to figure that out. Add a journal to you. Add a general to you. Why not? Let's add generals where we can. We have them. We might as well use them. Uh, let's go ahead and take your heal. Add a general to you. We'll, fine, we'll use this one. I have, I've been kind of avoiding using my own person, so maybe I'll start doing that at some point. You have a promotion. Production for Roma. Um, let's see here. I just wanted to double check, make sure we didn't just have Legionary in there and I just wasn't paying attention. Uh, I don't know, actually. Plus two per year. I mean, actually, honestly, some more civics wouldn't be terrible. We also have a lot of citizen things we can put out there. Let's, uh, let's queue up one of those. Um... Yeah, sure. Some woodcutter stuff. For reasons. I mean, we can always sell the wood to... We actually, wood sells for a lot. We can sell the wood to make up some money as well. You just finished your archive, which is awesome. You've already got your festival going at least once. We do have three citizens here. These are all basically the same. Ambassador. Promote ambassador. Get some more player opinion, which feels like relevant because of what we're doing. Yeah, let's do that. More opinion from our people, from the people that we're going out there to make happy. Common love. Your daughter is acting odd. She laughs at nothing, writes poetry, and spends hours gazing into the warm glow of sunset. One day she reveals the truth. She's in love with a commoner. Family and lineage always come first. Always. She becomes disappointed with us. Or follow your heart and happiness. She marries somebody who... I mean, not the worst person in the world, although it does lower legitimacy. But oh yeah, why not? We're well over 100 legitimacy. That's awesome. Dinner with a rival. Delegation from Persia, etc. This is the one where we have to pick somebody. Opinion goes up. Duchess consort a mistress. That's my daughter-in-law. It's 
So this one crew purges happiness of us. This one would lower it, but she becomes endeared to us. Eh, we'll do this one. Why not? We'll make people happy. Choose research. Hey, doctrine. It does look like that might potentially, possibly, hopefully, help us towards legionaries. Great thinkers. One of our most prosperous neighborhoods has become home to a burgeoning intellectual movement. One of the capital's most talented young figures emerged from this area, and we should take notice. Well, whom should we bring to the court? We can lose some money, get a great scientist. We lose some money, get a great minister. Or we cannot afford the education. No, we'll take the education. Let's take the scientist. Mercenary band of camel archers has arrived in the capital, offering its allegiance for a price. A thousand to get some camel archers. Why not? We got money to burn. Let's burn some money. Uh, court merchants have arrived from Assyria with offer of trade. They believe our nations will grow, etc., etc. Uh, actually, there's a whole bunch of stone, but we can take them science. Yeah, let's do the science. Trade stone for science. We have a ballista. We have a camel archer. Do we have any generals left? Ah, we actually have Claudia, the scientist. Oh, but she's currently tutoring, so let's not worry about that. There's a camel archer. Could promote you. Might as well. Eagle Eye. Eagle Eye feels pretty good for archers, to be fair. Just there by chill. End turn. Hopefully Doctrine gives us an idea of how to get the legionary things. Actually, I probably could search for them. Come to think of it. Oh, I'm already about to die. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, let's go to the help screen. Look up legionaries. Oh, this one up. Oh, we need the Hestat Hestatus. Hestatus. They have great legionaries. Requires Citadel. So requires Citadel. Okay. So we need to make Citadels. How do we get Citadels? None of these things. Citadels come from... Not that. There's barracks. Uh, yet again, I don't actually know where citadels come from. Okay, I guess we can search for citadels. Citadel. Uh, require tech sovereignty. Okay. Let's go look at the text to see if we can find out where sovereignty is. Sovereignty is there. Oh, okay, okay. It starts off as a garrison, then we can upgrade it to a stronghold, and then a citadel. Okay, so we need some garrisons. Gotcha. Okay, we can we can work on that, I think. During construction in Ostia, laborers unearth an aged temple beneath the site. All work paused until a decision made what to do. We can gain an acolyte, or we can get some stone. That's a lot of stone. But acolyte feels like a good idea. Feels more long-term. Our stone issues are probably just for the moment. Starts goal, found a city. Uh, after days of meditation, Royal Seer suggests this would be an auspicious time to found a new city. I mean, we don't really have a place to found a city, is the problem. Like, we literally don't. We'd have to go destroy something somewhere, which I don't feel like is on our list of things to do right now. And there's no, like, barbarians for us to go after nearby. I mean, we come over here, but that still, I think, I think we would just take that city. I don't think we would open up a spot to found a city. As bad as it is, we're going to have to take the, that, because I don't think anything else was really going to help us. Oh, I don't know why that came off of there. I guess because I was looking at it for a second. Yeah, the promotion. We also have a promotion. A lot of trees around to be fair, but I'll probably forget to do that to be honest. I mean, the crit thing's at least always active. Alright, uh, just by a century for now. I mean, I'm not really doing much with you guys. Um, we just finished the forum. We can get even more culture coming in. We're actually getting quite a bit of culture, to be fair. Farmer, some more farmers. 
Uh, actually, you know what? Let's do some workers. See if we can get some more some citadels laid down somewhere. Sure. I like it. You. Honestly, another festival wouldn't be bad. Everybody's turns. Circus Maximus. Oh, our ruler's dead. Of course. Queen Vespania Fabia the New. Age 37. Not too bad. Snake signs. The week before your coronation, a seer discovers a strange omen. Discovers a, a strange omen. One dead snake near the palace with three living baby snakes in nests nearby. Startled, he interprets this to mean that you must hold the ceremony in one of the family seats. Which city do you choose? Uh, none of the above. Looks like Claudius would be the best. So loses us some money. Probably okay. But it makes everybody happy at the moment. Choose city governor, Ostia. Honestly, all of these are going to be okay. They all have the same level of discipline. It's really a matter of the charisma versus wisdom. Let's go for the wisdom. Choose ambition. So we still have the legacy ambition. Two max level units, melee and ranged. Two max level units. I wonder what max level means. Control 100 population. Apparently we're at 50 population right now, so we're halfway there. Uh, require four courtiers added. Add four courtiers. Huh. I mean, it feels like this is something we would eventually get to who? Although it's probably going to take us a while. We want to focus, on, I'm assuming, on growth at that point. We're halfway there at the moment. I don't know. Let's go for that. Let's see if we can work on that. Halfway there, this far into the game. Feels like it's going to take us a while, but we'll see what we can do. Alrighty. We'll do some wood cutting if we wanted you to, but I don't know if that's going to be what we want. Farms, I mean, growth and stuff. We just talked about food and growth and things. Build a barracks. Enables officer. Let's do this. Let's do a farm. All the sentries. Just try to chill. All right. Um, I kind of feel like you need to do a worker as well, just to help us like get some of the stuff set up that we want. Let's do a disciple. All right. What do we need to do here? I mean, opening up the Spy Master wouldn't be bad. I don't think the harbor, buyer, any of that stuff really helps. Although the colonization and stuff could be useful. We'll do that. Cottage decor. The new cottages near Kapua give the court designers an opportunity to show off the good taste. How should we decorate? Fill them with lavish works of art. Or make them happier with us, which they are currently unhappy with us. Sure, we'll make them happy. Rampant corruption. Corruption is running rampant in Eretium. A characteristic local aristocrat has pledged to root out crooked administrators and restore some semblance of virtue. Shall we acknowledge his efforts? Less discontent level. Lots less discontent level. I feel like the less discontent level is a great idea. What was I going to do with you? Oh, I guess I can build a pasture. That looks like a good idea. Still need more stone stuff. Year 100. Lighthouses. Man, Greece is just going to destroy us. They are almost two-thirds of the way there, and we are barely half. Hmm. It is what it is. Ah, we got some more population, though. We went up to 53, so... It is going up, to be fair. So that that's a thing. Um, you, I mean, more quarries. Honestly, we need we need a lot more quarries. 
we're, we're low on the stone, and that's really going to help us out in a lot, of, a lot of other areas. A young man claiming to be a prophet seeks permission to build a permanent home for his people. Nomads, they have wandered the wilderness for generations and now seek to establish a spiritual homeland. We have heard fascinating tales of these chosen people and their god. Spread Judaism to Roma, which would actually not be bad. Yeah, let's do that, because that gives us two, three of them that are Judaism, which allows us to potentially claim that religion uh, and make a lot more people happy. Chancellor candidates. Um, that's a good question. Probably Sextus here. Yeah, that looks good. Alrighty. Uh, we got idle military units. Just sentry. That way there's no more idle military units. We're making a lot of money just off of our orders at the moment. I have a feeling this game is going to be over pretty quickly. Swordman, horseman, or maceman. Let's do the maceman. I bet that's an upgrade for at least something we have, maybe. Oh, well, maybe not. I thought we had a swordman, but I think we actually already lost our swordman. You. Yeah, I do want to build the garrison, right? Was it the garrison? I actually forgot all of a sudden. Citadel comes from garrison, yes. So we want this garrison. To hopefully eventually upgrade it to something. Um, we do need some stone. So we'll just... What is it we want to do? We want to... Uh, where's the garrison? I am blind. Oh, there it is. Down at the bottom. Choose production of Roma. Just finished a woodcutter. I mean, we need more stone things. But let's do us another worker here. Let's just get a lot of workers going out doing the garrison things. Do we even have a garrison already? I thought we already had one, but apparently... What is this? This is a... Range, okay. Woodcutter. See, I don't think we have the garrison yet after all. Okay, good to know. Choose production here. You have a worker. So I don't know that we need to work. worry about that right this second. We actually have a couple citizens. I mean, more growth, more population. I mean, in theory, that's a, a way to go. Again, kind of the same idea here. Just continue to get the growth going. Up to 53. Yeah, I don't know how we're going to get the legionaries. Oh, my ambassador has died. That's so sad. Can we? We've got two people. Neither one of them is really all that great. Um, we'll come back to that in a second. Why is it doing this? Okay, I'm confused. We'll figure that out in a minute. <laughs> it's just kind of confusing me. Uh, I think we need more stone coming in. We're just we're really light on the stone. Master Acolyte. Uh, I mean, let's get you a worker too. Let's just get everybody a worker to go out there and do stuff in their cities. Gowns of Silk. Your brother's servants comes with a request. Servius wishes to procure gold from the treasury to purchase silk for new fineries. He insists this is required for his royal position. Sure. Um, more stone. I mean, again, I feel like stone is our problem right now. Although, also, just doing the garrison things. Although, we can't do the garrisons without the stone. Stone is our problem. So, nope, let's do the stone. Julius is very unhappy with us. We can get us a trireme or a bireme. I don't feel like either one of those is useful. Uh, sure, let's go for the mounted archery. Although, walls and spymaster. You know what? Let's do the walls and spymaster. It's only one turn. Get that and be done with it. Uh, courthouse. Have a barracks. Build a stronghold. Enable citadel. Okay, I mean, it's enabling a citadel sounds like a great idea. Stronghold. Hey, we can build the great ziggurats. Requires holy city, any religion. Huh. I mean, it's a lot for us to get to. Um, this is going to cost us a lot of money because we don't have the stone. 
We have a lot of wood though to sell if we get short on money. We also gold. Maybe that'll work us towards a citadel. Um, sure, since we're low on stone at the moment. Let's do a farm over here. I mean, that's another one of our ambitions anyway. I mean, the growth stuff, maybe? I have a citizen, although we might want the citizen for this thing when it's done. So we may hold off. Sure, let's do a round of festivals. I mean, we're still a long ways away from this thing. But at least we're making progress. Despite the truce, uh, the king claims that Roman agitators are causing unrest in Carthage. We and Rome clean up our messes. So he gets happier with us. We lose some money. We gain some legitimacy. Oh, we'll take that. We'll be okay with that. Choose research. Gets us a moat and an aqueduct. Does get us some more growth stuff. Coinage. Markets. Yeah, sure, why not? Air education. Uh, I don't think we've done philosophy in a while. Choose production. Just finished a worker. Uh, let's do a festival just to continue to lower our unhappiness. Feels like a good idea. Worker. We want to build a build a library. Uh, I mean, a stronghold would be fine if we had the stone for it. And we can sell stuff if we don't. Yeah, because that's a garrison and we want the stronghold. Okay. I think that's what we're wanting, assuming that I'm understanding what we're trying to do correctly. All right. No, go away. Uh, next unit. You. Do we have a general we can give you? We do actually have a... Uh, no, they're currently tutoring, so never mind. And I don't want to put myself in charge, I don't think. That would give them some XP. Yeah, why not? Give her some discipline. Give her some courage. More XP. Yeah, why not? Let's do the XP stuff. All right, what is this? Governor of Ostia. Oh, was she the governor of Ostia? She probably was. Looks like Rhea is a pretty good one. Uh, more quarries. Uh, I feel like we just got to keep pushing the quarries up because that is the thing that we're needing the most right now. These clouds and storm effects are kind of cool. Immigrants. A rabble of barbarian refugees have settled outside the gates of Capua. They request our aid and sanctuary. What should we tell them? Plus one citizen. Oh, no, we'll take the citizen for sure. Cause that's That's what we're trying to get. Anyway. Our allegiance. Murmurs of discontent can be heard in military camps across Roma with the rise of Zoroastrianism. Many of the adherents claim that they are soldiers for Ahura Mazda. Such a bold statement unnerves the other men who have pledged allegiance to you. For whom do our armies fight? Our queen or our god? Um, we're going to say we're going to take some free science. Sure. I like it. Uh, we gotta pick something here. We can get a free Axeman. We can get us a free Hestatus. It has to upgrade to the Legionnaire. So, nah, let's do that. Alright. More Storm Quarries. Again, that feels like the thing that is hurting us the most. This whole city is gonna be Storm Quarries. Uh, here's our worker. Farms would be good. Garrison would be good. And the garrison is. Yes, that's fine. But which the stronghold enables the citadel, right? That, that's, that's what I'm remembering. Although we may not need this many, to be fair. Uh, let's do the quarry over here. We've got good quarry sites. We'll definitely do those because, again, that's the thing we're, we're shortest on. Um, next unit. Archer here. Could promote, but we're not going to do that right this second. Choose production. Uh, probably more 
stonecutter peoples. Or growth. One of the two. We got lots of citizens. Let's do the stonecutter first. You can do some more growth. We have lots of citizens as well. You have like nothing you can work on right this second. Could do another festival. Why not? Ooh, Greece is up to 20 of 30. This game might be over pretty quickly here. Ah, the king of Carthage is dead. Long live the new queen. Does that change anything here? Ah, they're actually happy with us, of all things. City governor. Uh, that's a tough one. Plus two cultural, culture per culture level. It's interesting. I definitely don't want that. Let's just use him. He'll be all right. Colonization or serfdom. Can buy tiles or farm outputs plus 20%. Ooh, that's a toughie. Let's... Let's look at this just to make sure we're not missing something that could be there. This one creates Claudius' opinion of us. I also have tolerance and orthodoxy over here. I mean, more output from farms helps us grow, which helps us all uh, with our thing. Let's do that. Because that's going to help us with our... Presumably, that helps us with our population. Or is that just purely the food? I may be mis understanding the two connections between the food and the growth. The mysterious Jewish prophet Moses has suffered a grave loss. His wife has died, and he wishes to buy royal land and wish to buy, build a tomb. But it would be more beneficial to us for him to pay annual rent. Moses' followers hang on his every word. To resist his wishes may incur him. No, we don't want to make him mad. Yeah, we haven't been using all of our orders anyway. By all means. Let's make the Jewish guys happy. Barracks, shrine... The farm. Sure, all the farms. I don't know. Probably silly, but let's do it. Archer. Hey, you have a promotion. Combat tracker, garrison, or shield breaker. Let's do the combat. Production. Got three citizens. We'll do that. All right, well, that's the end of our turn, and we're going to go ahead and put a cut in there. When we come back, we'll see if we can finish off some more ambitions. I mean, we're making progress towards this one. It's a long ways away still, but we're making progress. Uh, and then we'll figure out uh, if we can get the legionaries at some point. Uh, we do want an ambassador, probably. Yeah. Oh, we don't have 100. Never mind. Uh, we'll get to that in a minute. It uh, looks like Greece may be winning the game here soon, but that's okay. I mean, it's our first playthrough, and we're kind of learning some stuff, so... But I do appreciate you guys watching, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye.